Hi folks, Fan Prepper here. I am going to be building my own gun safe in this closet in our attic in our home. And uh, this is what it looks like right now. Really nothing going on in there. And we're going to keep tabs on it and I'll keep you updated as we go. I've got the carpet down on the floor. Getting a little help from this girl right here. Uh, and all I did so far besides the carpet was put uh, these side rails in. Just a couple of old pieces of wood and put these yeah. hooks in each there, each one yeah. down the side every two and a half inches and that'll give me a place for the rifle barrels to rest. Got the hooks into the side rails coming together nice. I picked up some digital camo material at the dollar store. An exceptionally good deal. It was more than a yard for a dollar uh, and I'm uh, going to line the inside of it with this. I don't know how well that'll come out on the video here but got one side of it done you'll see it a lot better once it's all in there but uh, I am certainly not an artisan like artisan Tony but I'm doing the best I can here in here we've got the camo pattern almost completely done uh, the hooks are up the camo patterns almost completely done just got this little patch up here and then we're gonna be ready to put the door on well we've got all the rifles moved in here, still got some empty spaces. Got room for four more down this side. That's our Mosin Nagant side, so we got room for four more. You guys know what that means, and uh, we'll um, gonna move the ammo in here too. This closet looks like it'll be plenty big enough for the guns, and hopefully we'll see how much ammo we can stuff in the back there. Here's what it looks like with all the guns and the ammo in it. There's actually a little bit more ammo to go in here. It's going to be packed up pretty tight. I still have to put the door on it. I had to reinforce the floor under it just to make sure it didn't come crashing down on me. I think we're pretty safe but a little bit extra never hurts, right? Here's the final product everybody. Got the whole thing lined including the door. Uh, built the door out of old wood that I had in the garage. Uh, everything you see here, the only things I had to buy were the hooks, the fabric, the two locks, and the two latch systems, and the grand total was $31. So I built a walk-in, made a closet into a walk-in gun and ammo storage space that's uh, secure and locked up for $31. And that is how you earn your reputation for being spectacularly cheap. I'm Van Prepper. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope it inspired you. Let me know what you think. Happy shooting, everybody.